Hey, is that folk music that you play there? What is that? How do you call that folk music? <laughs> I think it was Studs Terkel who asked Big Bill Brunzi, did he consider his blues music to be folk music? And Big Bill says, well, I never heard, heard no horse sing from there. <laughs> I'd like to be the light that shines upon the actress Or the golden, pink, and purple dancing lights In the sequins of her dress If only for a flickering light or a momentary spark I'd take my flashlight everywhere Keep away the dark And make my stand Oh, it's all so grand Fly for just a dreaming in the garden Or oh, would you dream with me? We'd sit and smell the flowers And tell jokes and share a cup of jasmine tea If God were passing by, I really hope that we won't miss him. We'd bake a cake, celebrate, we'd hug him and we'd kiss him and shake his hand. Oh, it's all so grand. show is Horses Sing None of It. My name is Ralph Litwin and our guest is all the way from Charlestown, West Virginia. That's right. And he's a winner in, of honors in a numerous songwriting competitions. He's a multi-instrumentalist and he's on his way to play at the Good Coffee House in Brooklyn, New York. His name is David LaFleur. Nice to meet you. Welcome. <clears throat> Thank you. Nice to be here. Well, what do you want to play for us on the mandolin? Well, uh, let's see. This is an old folk song. It started out as a uh, an English uh, folk song called uh, Matty Groves. But uh, that was a tale of uh, adultery and murder between the classes. And I think when it came out to the United States, I think the uh, somewhat puritanical uh, Americans 
uh, and Democratic Americans kind of turned it into a pure little love ditty. But it is confusing because there is a, uh, a horse involved, which I thought would be appropriate for the show. So this song is called Shady Grove. David, tell us, how did you get your start in music? Um, well, um, I started playing guitar when I was eight. And um, <clears throat> I saved up my money. I got a, a silver, Sears a silver tone guitar, $17.99. And uh, the next year, I bought a telescope. And so I like to think that my destiny was to basically stare off into space and play an instrument. So, anyway, that's what I like to think. What inspired you to buy that first guitar? Um, you know, it was it was cool. Um, I remember um, first thing I learned was the uh, the Batman thing. <laughs> you know, that was the coolest thing. And uh, and I can't get no satisfaction. <laughs> And, uh, you know, you had the hair that went down like that, and you were always going like this, because that was cool. You know, the hair that... <laughs> so, the um, beetle haircut. I wanted to be cool. Okay. <laughs> and I'm honest enough to admit it. So this is a song... Um, 
I just wrote just re recently. Um, I was in a, a little town <clears throat> and decided to stop at the local diner and uh, this is what happened. It was a rainy night and I was just passing through on a four day road trip out from Kalamazoo. It's true. In a tiny little diner near Hackensack right next to the railroad track. The sign said Mom's Place. Home cooking. While I was sitting at the counter looking at the pies. Mm -hmm. I had a conversation with a guy named Guy. Uh -huh. Well, he gave me a look as he wiped his sleeve He said, son, let me warn you Before I leave Don't you eat the shepherd's pie Here at Mom's place The meat cloth is fine Home fries are divine The feel is quite a deal And it comes with a glass of wine But son, take my advice Shepherd's pie at mom's place. <laughs> Just about one year later, I was passing through. This time by way of Timbuktu, it's true. I had no choice, I was hungry and broke. It was only $4.95 and it came with a coat. I ate the whole dang thing at Mom's place. Mom's place. So call 911, I think I'm gonna die. Shepherd's pie, no, no. Give my love to Renee, cause it just might pass away. And Ralph, won't you heed my advice? The meat cloth is fine, the home fries are divine, yes, sir. Mom's place Just outside Hackensack Right next to the railroad track They call it Mom's place Ooh. Yeah All right <laughs> Now we've got a hack and sack in New Jersey. Well, you know, that's just poetic license. It really wasn't hack and sack in New Jersey. All I can say is if you're ever in Leesburg, Virginia, just be very careful. <laughs> okay, I'll we'll take that advice from you. So, um, this instrument is called a dulcimer or a lap dulcimer, or a mountain dulcimer, or a hog stick. <clears throat> a hog stick? Yeah, I used I to think they called it that it, Yeah, uh, I used to think they called it a hog stick because it's big enough to hit a hog with, but if you listen real closely, you can hear it has sort of a nasal sound. Are you listening? <laughs> hear that? See? Um, and it's, it's thought that the Scandinavians, when they settled in the Appalachian Mountains, took earlier instruments and simplified them. Um, 
gave it less strings and made it easier to build, called it a dulcimer, which is a combination of two words, dolce and melos, which of course together mean, hey baby, let's go out and party tonight. Not really. Um, dolce means sweet and melos means song. And they used to name their daughters Dolcina. And they wouldn't name all their daughters Dolcina, that would be totally confusing, but they would at least name some of the daughters uh, Dolcina in the hopes that they would grow up to be as sweet as the sound of a dulcimer. So this is a very old uh, Irish uh, air called She Moved Through the Fair. said to me, my mother won't mind, and my father won't slight you for your lack of kind. She went away from me, and this she did say. Well, it will not be long, long, till our wedding day. She went away from me as she moved through the fair. And slowly I watched her move here and move there. She went to a homework at first star away Like the swan in the evening goes over the That my own love came in She came in so sweetly Her feet made no din She came close beside me And this she did say Well it will not be long love to our wedding day. No, it will not be long, love, to our wedding. Very pretty tune, nicely performed. Thank you. We should tell folks how they can find out more about your touring schedule and your recording. They can go to davidlafleurmusic.com or they can email you at davidlafleur at adelphia. Is that right? Adelphia.com? Dot net. Dot net. David Lafleur, or rather Dr. Lafleur at adelphia.net. So did you want to play one together? Or 
You've got time for uh, two more. Oh, great. Okay. Unless I'm reading my watch wrong. No, uh, you've got uh, seven minutes. Okay. <laughs> song I wrote for my parents. This song is called Sweet Joan Carey. Born on a morning when frost shone like bright diamonds out for all the joy there was to be found wild as a stallion in the springtime running over Sweet 
show your recording Blue Ridge is the name of the most yeah. recent recording Blue Ridge I live in the uh, northern tips of the Blue Ridge Mountains in Charlestown West Virginia and for more information people can go to www.davidlafleurmusic.com what you got cooked up here well um, this song is called Raise some hell. Moses went up the mountain, said, Lord, what should I do? Lord said, I'll part the waters, and you free all the Jews, so we do come down to the promised land. He says, hallelujah, I think I understand. desert for 40 days and nights came back with the sunburn said man I got it right cause I fought the devil in the burn 